Welcome to 5th grade math standards of learning. Today we are looking at the order of operations. And the order of operation is parentheses, exponents, multiplication, division, addition, subtraction. And as you notice, multiplication and division, we perform these operations from left to right. That means whichever one comes first. So if multiplication is first, we do that. But if, it, if division is first, that means we have to do that. And the same applies for addition and subtraction. So let's look at two examples, which shows the first step in simplifying the expression. So when we're simplifying an expression, all we have to do is just remember PEMDAS and we'll never go wrong. So let's look at this expression, 16 divided by 2 plus 6, parentheses 7 plus 4 times 5, parentheses. So which is the first step? So we know the first step is parentheses. So this is our parentheses. This is what we're solving. That's the, our first step. However, you notice there are two operations in the parentheses. Normally, we perform our operations one at a time. So we have to go back, even though we know it's parentheses first, but we have two operations. So according to PEMDAS, we have to do the multiplication part first. So let's simplify this parentheses. So we're still going to have a parenthesis, but we're going to have this 7 plus, and we're going to have 4 times 5, 20, because multiplication comes first. And that's our first step in solving, in simplifying this exp expression, and that is all we are asked for. So let's see which one of these options is correct. First of all, we're going to eliminate number 1. Letter A, because when we're simplifying an expression, we do, we perform operations one at a time. So whatever operation we are not performing, we just put it down just as it is. So this one starts with 16 divided by 2. They start with 8. So we evidently eliminate option A. We're also going to eliminate option B because Six, this says 16 divided by 8, and this is 16 divided by 2. Let's look at option C. 16 divided by 2 plus 6. Yes, we have that. Now, remember, our parentheses now is 7 plus 20. This says 11 times 5, so that is not correct. And our last option, option D, 16 and we can read it from here. 16 divided by 2 plus 6, parentheses 7 plus 20. 16 divided by 2 plus 6, parentheses 7 plus 20. So D is our correct option. So let's move on to... to Number two, example two, simplify 12 times 4, parentheses 4 plus 1, parentheses plus 9, divided by 3. So we know, according to PEMDAS, parentheses first. We are not doing multiplication yet, so we're going to just put that down just the way it is. And we're going to simplify parentheses, which is 4 plus 1 is 5. And we continue, plus 9. And we put back our divide by 3. That is step 1. Now step 2. There are no parentheses. So our next thing, we, in 5th grade, we, we're not really concerned about exponents. So the next step, multiplication and division. Now we have both multiplication and division, but as we said, working from the left to right, 
So multiplication comes first. So we're going to perform multiplication. 12 times 5, 60. Plus 9 divided by 3. Next step, we have addition and division. Division comes first. So we're going to put back our 60 plus 9 divided by 3, 3. And then one more operation, 60 plus 3, 60, 3. And there you have it. Thanks for watching. I hope you find this very helpful. Remember, when we're simplifying expression, all you have to do is remember PEMDAS and you will never go wrong. Please remember to like, share, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video.